he hate us so much? Tu primera guerra fría. It's showtime, Mason. What'd you see, Woods? Sand. Sand and more fucking sand. Hudson's contact's on his way. You reckon we can trust the Chinese? We can't hear. They've been supporting the Mujahideen same as us. They know if Russian was in Afghanistan, they'd be looking at China next. No one likes the Russians, huh? You know me. I don't like anyone. You might want to get your head down. Take it easy, Sal! We deliver the weapons. Now, what about your end of the deal? I will take you to the leader of the Mujahideen. He can help you find Raoul Menendez. Now, we have fresh horses. You will follow. Oh, shit. Let's do it. Mason, it's Hudson. Did you make contact with Jiao? We're on our way to the Mujahideen camp now. I'm sure I don't need to remind you that our presence here must remain 100% deniable. There will be serious consequences if Russia learns of our involvement in Afghanistan. Yo, that ain't gonna happen. We must hurry. We believe the Soviets are about to launch an attack on the camp. Major, kick it up a gear! Yeah! Yeah! This way. First we must hurry! We cannot allow them to enter the valley! Settle up, Mason! Tougher than we thought. We got hips dropping infantry right in front of the camp. Leave up to the Mujahideen. Just get to the two points and hold back the armor. Close! Follow me!
BTR's history! Charge set! Retreat to a safe distance! Blow it, Mason! Upset! The West Choke Point is secure! Armor ain't getting through this way! Woods, Mason, they're throwing everything they have at us. We've got threats all over the valley. Boozer reporting rushing tanks moving in from the north. Brute force and strength in numbers? You expected such a fight.
man was one tough son of a bitch. Bet your ass he was. Kravchenko basically carved the hole in this head. He sucked those fucking numbers in there, and he survived that. No. <laughs> they just say they didn't see those numbers anymore, but I don't know. I'm not so sure about that. Mason, better take a look. This isn't over yet. The Russians want to give us one last display of brute force. Let's give them one last display of courage. You with me? Kravchenko. Piece of shit. Of course he's involved in all this. Kravchenko must die. A couple times, I saw the tick. And I get that look in his eyes. He's scanning the room. <laughs> Next thing you know, he's talking to the Russian. Fucking Reznov. <laughs> Good old Tricky Vic. Woods, maybe I should handle this interrogation. Maybe you stay the fuck out of my way. I can unfinish business with this bastard. <clears throat> I left you to rot in Vietnam, Sergeant Woods. You should be dead. Well, nobody told me. My buddy Raman tells me you're doing business with a Nicaraguan named Raul Menendez. What do you do for him? Fuck you. You believe in an eye for an eye? Huh? This is a Mujahideen, baby. They'll bury you up to your neck, peel your eyelids back, and leave you to fry in the desert. I'll take you out quick. Tell me about Menendez. I sell him weapons. That doesn't Must sound die. too Soviet of you, brother. The Soviet Union is dying. Money is all that matters. Where do the weapons go? Cuba. Angola. The Third World. Why? Menendez wants to see your world burn. But that's not gonna happen. Oh. <laughs> He's more powerful than you know. He even has people in the CIA. Bullshit! <laughs> this guy's fucking with us. The fuck are you doing? Menendez told me you must suffer. You face piece of shit. We helped you fight the Russians We're on your side. No. No, you are, and always will be, our true enemy. <laughs> Without water and shelter, you may last a day. If you are strong...
So, we're in a desert, buried, the year. And who does your father think rides up on a horse to save us? Tricky Vic. Ha! <laughs> See? You're just like your old man. No, it wasn't him. That's not. Come on, if you think it was him, don't you think he would have stuck around for a bit, huh? Maybe explain some shit? 